Okay, I'm about to really report y'all if y'all don't back up. Yeah. I need y'all to back up. to try to make this as quick as possible because i am running behind it is now 9 39 and i was supposed to be out of here by um 9 30 the latest so i am running behind but as you can see i did my morning routine but let me go ahead and introduce myself first to all my new bougie base who's just now tuning in and trying to figure out who is this girl so I'm your girl Paris Dior. I am the owner of Pretty Bougie Boutique, all things fashion. I'm your go-to girl for clothes, shoes, accessories, all that good stuff. I'll drop my website link down in the descriptions below. And I also I am also a hairstylist here in Atlanta. So if you ever need your hair done, I am her. Okay. I'll go ahead and also tag my Instagram handles for my boutique. And my hair page that you can follow as well. That's why I keep in contact with all my girls. Especially on my hair page. Because that's kind of like my personal page as well. But besides that, this is a safe haven for all things hair, fashion, beauty, entrepreneurship. And a little vloggy vlog of my life. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, girl. Now let's get to it. So as you can see, your girl is in a rush, okay? So I was supposed to be out of here by 9.30. Um, to go ahead and pick up the keys for my um, store location. So I am taking... Hold on. Okay. So I am taking y'all with me um, to go pick up my keys. Okay. Because the store location is about to open. So I'm like in a rush. But I'm going to just run down the to-do list real quick or whatever. So what we're doing today is have to go ship off orders, pick up the keys, meet my vendors. Um, now I'm also trying to save money with not eating out. Because I've been eating out like crazy. It's ridiculous. But my homegirl, she wants to meet up. So we can go to the seafood spot. So we're going to do that. And also, we're going to do a few other errands or whatever. So, yeah. I'll drop the to-do list right here so y'all can see. Because I'll probably be missing some stuff. So, let me go ahead and make my bagel. So we can get up out of here. And I'll see y'all on my way out. All right, babe. So I am now in the car. As you can see, I had to put all the boxes in the car and it was a disaster. Like, I don't have time for it. But, so what I'm going to try to do is when I get over there, I'm going to stop at Home Depot and see like if I can find a contractor to actually like come and put up my shelves or whatever and take these boxes out of the car because I'm not looking to do it. Like, mm -mm. But anyway, so yeah, I'm on my way. I'm on my way to the suite to go pick up my keys. Ah! <laughs> I'm on my way to go pick up my keys. I'm super excited. This is the first day. Um, they did a few renovations in there. So like this is my first time seeing it. So we're seeing it together for the very first time. I'm excited. So let's go ahead and head there. And I will see y'all soon. I'll see y'all soon, okay? So, I'll let y'all know when I get there. All right, babe. So, I just made it here. And I'm super excited. So, let's go in and pick up these keys. I don't want to be all in a man, man face recording. So, I'm going to come back when I get the keys. All right, babe. So, as y'all can see, um, they were still working on it or whatever. He said that they'll be done by 12, 12 30, the latest. So, pretty much, I guess I'm just hanging out in the city until um, 
it's time for me to come back like around 12 12 30 so yeah so now i think i'm going to go and take care of a few more errands that i had to take care of and then i guess just to waste time so let's see what we got on our agenda today so i can at least get those things done in the city oh i have to go ship off orders so i guess i can ship off orders now go ahead and take care of that and run a few more errands that i had to do while i'm in the city um i want to say i have to meet my vendors but we'll be back we'll be back at 12 30 and they better be done they better be done you said a guy who does your hair Mm -hmm. He live in, you know, he live in Michigan. Oh, they just standing out here. Hold on, I'm finna ask. Hold on, right quick, I'm finna ask one of them. Okay. Excuse me. Are you guys looking for work? They're like this. I need like two of them put up. They go on the wall on the wall yeah they're like um pole mount things oh you don't understand Which english i need shelves put up on the on the wall oh you need some shelves on the wall yeah like okay. these shelves right here all right so if you didn't know now you know i just put y'all on so if you don't want to pay so much for a contractor like so if you didn't know, now you know. I, I just put y'all on. I just built C, okay? So if you don't want to pay so much um, money for a contractor, you can always go to Home Depot. Y'all know like them Mexicans and them Haitians, like all them, they be sitting on the side of the road. Like the reason why they be standing on the side of the road is because they be looking for help. Like they be looking for work or whatever. Not help, work. They be looking for work. So if you don't want to pay so much money for a contractor because you know some of these contractors with businesses they be charging like thousands of dollars just to put up a um, put up a shelf or something like that so you can easily go to home depot and ask the mexicans out there like hey like how much you'll charge to put this up Try, usually sometimes they be charging little to no money sometimes 100 150 like what's that compared to a thousand and something dollars like thousands of dollars so like i said if you didn't know i just put you on okay so we just left home depot now i am on my way to ship off orders trying to like bypass time or whatever until like 12 12 30 it is now what time is it it is now 10 54 so we're trying to bypass a lot of time probably like an hour i probably go back like around 12 12 30. Okay, we're just now leaving the postal office. We're dropping orders off. It is now 11.23. So, um, oh, I have to go meet my vendor. So I'll go do that now. So I'll see y'all when I get there. Y'all, it's not even 12 noon yet. And I feel like this day has already been draining. Like, <laughs> but oh, I'm just ready for this day to be over with now like now you know what not not even that i'm just ready to eat i'm ready to eat but um i'm actually on my way to my vendor now and then after that it should be time to go back to the store to pick up the keys so and he better have them ready Whew, i'm so tired i'm so tired but we going to get through today we're going to get through today so i just left my vendor i didn't like too many pieces there so um 
I left and I guess I just gotta wait till some new arrivals drop or whatever so we didn't get no new pieces today that I'm able to show y'all but oh I got some new pieces coming in through the mail so I can show y'all those but for my vendors for today nah we ain't get nothing so now I just pulled up to the suite so I can um see if they're done yet or how much longer they need and yeah so let's see if they're done <laughs> all right babe so they are almost done with the suite but while i'm sitting here waiting i just had to get something to eat so this place called jimmy tequilas i had got me a rib eye and some rice and beans they rice and beans so good i had to get two i'm a fat girl and they gave me some sauce so yes yeah, so let's chow down okay Y'all, I am a total fat girl. Let's hope I don't get none of this on my clothes. Because right now, I'm so hungry. So hungry. Mm. I'm going to put this right here. I should have got me some to drink. Let me cut into this steak, honey. And I got all this for $28. Don't y'all love a good lunch special? Love a good lunch special, honey. Huh. I'll be back. I need to eat. I'll be back. So, we finally got the All right, y'all, so I had to close the door because I can't be too loud. Like, it's nobody in here, and I don't want to be too ghetto and loud. But, okay, so here's the suite. I'm going to take y'all on a journey with me of putting everything together. So today, the wall mount's going up for the clothing racks, and the desk is coming up today, too. So... It's small, but it's just good for me in my suite. And there's that side. Excuse my purse, but the desk, the registered desk is going to be right there. The dressing area is going to be right there. But like I said, I'm going to give y'all a part two as far as in like how the suite with the grand opening and how the suite came about, like how the suite came along. So... I'm just, this is the first video to show y'all that I got my keys and yeah. So like I said, it's for my small boutique, but we're going to make this thing work because I'm not sure if you can see, but I am on a very busy road. I'm exactly in the middle of the location where I want to be on Beaufort Highway. So... I'm happy with the area that I'm in. I'm happy with the suite. I'm happy with everything. So, yeah, let's start working. So, like I said, y'all, I can't be too loud. <laughs> but I'm excited. <laughs> so, like I said, the clothing rack is going up today on the wall. And the desk is coming in today as well. So, at least y'all going to see that. I'm excited, like, I'm excited. Only if y'all knew my journey. I'm going to tell y'all my journey, like, later on in the video, but I'm excited. sure if y'all can hear them they're currently putting up um my wall mounts for my clothes so i'm still here they have one more and they were supposed to put my registered desk together but that's not happening today because it is what time it is 4 43 so it's getting pretty late i've been up here since 10 30 
in like 10 39 10 40 so i'm like a little tired so most likely we're gonna come back and do the register desk but at least y'all can see the wall mount for the clothes up so and then the next video for the clothing boutique that i will drop will be the grand opening with the finished look and everything so yeah stay tuned i'm still here <laughs> So I'm going to do a quick walkthrough because I'm ready to go. But this is the look. So they put the poles up. So all the clothes are going to go against the wall. And then this is actually much bigger than I thought because the dressing area was going to go over there, remind you. So now I have to figure out where am I going to put the dressing area. But this is the look. And like I said, I will show y'all. I'll do a quick walkthrough so y'all can see.